to a week of workouts. It is the beginning of the new year, so why not start off with a motivating video? I was kind of debating whether to do a weekly vlog for you guys or a week of workouts, and I just figured a week of workouts would probably be more beneficial. I know a lot of us have some new New Year's resolutions. I want this video to help you guys um, get in that mindset of sticking to your goals and staying consistent. So I'm gonna start off with this week of workouts. It is Monday today. It is January 2nd, so it's a fresh start to the new year. I'm gonna stick to my usual plan. I don't know if you guys have watched my videos previously, but Mondays are always leg days for me. Then Tuesdays, it's like back and biceps. Wednesdays, shoulders and triceps. Fridays, full body, and then uh, Saturdays are like cardio and abs. I might kind of go with the flow this week and see if that works out or change something up. But I did want this video to help motivate you guys in getting started with the gym so you guys can build that habit for yourselves. So first things first, I wanted to show you guys my new planner. Now I just purchased this, actually I purchased this planner in November. So I kind of had like an idea of what I wanted to do for the beginning of the year and like how I wanted to stay consistent and motivated and I knew a planner would be very beneficial for me. I've actually bought a lot of planners in the past. Maybe some of you guys have too and you guys, you know, start off by using them and then you kind of get overwhelmed and you stop using it. So I can admit I've definitely been that person. So I was specifically looking for a very simple planner, kind of something that wasn't too overwhelming with like things to write. And I came across this one. I purchased this with my own money, by the way. It's not sponsored or anything. I purchased this one from Staples. I don't know if you guys have that that from where you are but it's just a like office supply store it comes with one sheet of note paper just at the beginning here i don't know maybe to write like kind of your own notes or like what you want to put in here and then just before we get into each month it actually has a bucket list so i really want to fill out this bucket list and i think i'm going to do that right now just to kind of give you guys an idea of the things that i have on my bucket list this year it has like so many lines but i guess as the year goes on you can always add to it and then what i also liked about this planner is the little calendar here for each month you obviously get these big calendar days and then you have a little to-do list here on the side. So I think what I'm going to do is probably write some video ideas or things that I need to do this month in particular. Um, and then for each day here, I might write out like my workouts and then my work schedule and then any birthdays that I have for my friends and family. And then lastly, it has these actual little paragraph areas and then a little to-do list of your daily tasks. And then you can check off once you've done them. thought this was like a perfect planner to start off with. I feel like it's not gonna be too overwhelming for me. So hopefully I can keep up with it. You guys, I'm guilty of not staying consistent. I mean, I feel like a lot of people are, but don't beat yourself up about it because it happens to everyone and everyone kind of goes through their own obstacles. No matter where you are in your journey, you guys, everyone's gonna be at different levels. Everyone's gonna, you know, stopping when they need to. What's most important is just staying consistent and keeping yourself accountable and, you know, making the small changes that you know you can maintain and keep up without having to overwhelm yourself. So as long as you get a couple of days out of the week out of the way that have been consistent, that is at least a good start than not getting anything done. Also, I was sick most of December, so I don't have any groceries. So in this video, I think I will add in a little segment of me going to the grocery store today because I do need to stock up on some things that I wanna cook. So let's go ahead and get started with this platter. They have like a bit of like an indent right here to kind of like accentuate the booty And then I just paired it up with this oversized Britney tee I feel like I wear this t-shirt a lot because I feel like it goes with a lot of my colored shorts And I love wearing baggy tees especially on leg day because it's super comfortable I don't have to worry about feeling too bloated anyways for pre-workout I'm gonna be drinking the oxy shred ultra energy also if you guys notice I do get ready for the gym It just helps me feel better about working out I feel good and it just gives me that extra boost of energy when I feel like I look good So that is why I wear makeup and a lot of people do so so if that works for you, then put on a full face of makeup and hit your workout.
Okay you guys, so I'm all done with the gym. I'm gonna quickly get ready and then we're gonna head to the grocery store and grab some groceries. And I think I'm gonna do a full grocery shop. First things first, I am gonna write a grocery list. So we'll quickly write a grocery list and then we'll head out to the grocery store. And then I think I wanna make like chicken pesto pasta tonight. Yeah, that'll be quick, so. To make a coffee. Oh my god, my friend's calling. I just quickly put on like some foundation, concealer, and mascara. And I put on this like H&M top. Put my hair half up because we're doing upper body. And I like to usually have like not all my hair up, especially if I washed it last night. Sorry, I'm just putting on some lotion. But I'm wearing these pink Bowen Tee leggings. They're just like full length leggings. I think I'm wearing the 270 Nike shoes. Anyways, let's hurry up and head to the gym. Got my pink earphones on to go with my little fit. Colada today. Let's head to the gym. Your boy got 
the full body do rag out. Drop the roof and let you smoke it. I got diamonds to win since he's sliding both in. Dice rolling on the Las Vegas trip tonight. Slip that on and we might miss the fight. Fuck a night, I keep the guala in my shorty bag. You know she wanna mind when she tattoo that ass. I'm a lover boy. She love the toys. Keep it coming, you a rider. It's that roll myself a day and count my figure shit. Just stepping out, I feel like I'm that nigga shit. I drop 30 on this room, we ain't gon' sleep for shit. If I catch you not off, then it's gon' be some shit. Well, you can do what you wanna, live how you wanna, spin what you wanna, be who you wanna be. We all stunner till I die. So I'm about to head out, but I just made a protein shake. I usually just put ice, banana, my protein powder. The protein powder I used was blessed and I used the chocolate milk one. It's like one of my favorites. I add peanut butter as well and water. Sometimes I'll do like oat milk or almond milk, but honestly it tastes the same with water. So I started just doing water now. I'm gonna head to my mom's house, pick her up, and then we gotta run some errands together. So I'll check in with you guys later because I think I'm gonna probably go out to eat uh, for lunch today. So I'll check in with you guys if we do that. Oh, no. My mom says no because they take out my camera because I want to show you guys what I'm about to eat. I wanted to go get sushi, but my mom was craving like White Spot. I don't know if you guys have White Spot. We were supposed to get Greek, but that place was closed. And then I was like, sushi, but she wants White Spot. So now we're at White Spot. This is the chicken cob salad. Yeah. I swear it had like a different name. It has like everything in it, you guys. I just wanted to keep it how it was made, but it looks so good. And I'm having some water in there. It's freezing down here. So, what is up, you guys? So it is Wednesday. I forgot my camera in the car from yesterday, so I just went to go grab it. I'm just in like the parkade. I already started drinking my oxy tread. Quickly show you guys what I'm wearing today. I'm wearing this Gymshark shark we'll see the top, and then just these black Shein leggings, and then my 270s but this is the fit for today. So I already woke up, filled up my platter. I had a coffee earlier. Sorry, I keep forgetting to like turn on my camera during that time, but honestly, my camera was in my car. So I was like, it's okay. I'll just tell you guys what I did. But I had a coffee, filled up my planner. Was on FaceTime with Nash for quite a bit because we we're just catching up because she hasn't been here and I've been missing her. So we were on FaceTime for a couple hours. So today we're working on shoulders and triceps, but I also want to redo my little cardio that I did on Monday because I was trying to send it to a brand, but I really didn't like the lighting. So I'm gonna redo it and try to get some clips on there because it's like still daytime out. So hopefully the lighting is a little bit better. And then also I put on an all black fit because I honestly feel like it'll look a little bit better. But right now I'm just gonna sip on my Oxy Shred. I'm gonna do a warm up using like that band um, for my arms, get them nice and loose, and then we'll head into our shoulder and tricep workout. Two days in a row, but 
I ate the pasta. I had like two servings. So yesterday I had a serving like half of this and then uh, I just finished the other half just now. But I forgot to show you guys. So it's the pasta that I made earlier this week, the prawn pesto pasta. But yeah, I forgot. I'm just editing here. But yeah, I'll uh, talk to y'all tomorrow with tomorrow's meals and workout routine. Guys, I'm gonna make some coffee and then I'm gonna make the same breakfast I had yesterday, the eggs and the hash brown mix. I don't know if sometimes you guys wake up and you're just starving. It's one of those days for me. Bread. I'll also add some berries. I'm kind of just like, I just want a big meal right now. So I'm gonna have this mix so it's like, Smoked bacon crumble, seasoned potatoes, bell peppers, onions. Perfect little mix with three eggs. Down, yeah. I've been feeling so, I've been feeling so down, yeah. Can you tell me why? Can you tell me why? I'm down, yeah. No friends of mine, no friends of mine around, yeah. Now I'm thinking now, now I'm thinking now. I got all ready for the gym and like honestly I need to take more than just an energy drink because these energy drinks I find like they have like the amount of energy in there but I think I need a little bit more I do have kind of an addiction with the energy drinks I'm not even gonna cap I'm gonna have the oxy shred hardcore sour creepy crawlies and I'm have a scoop of that we're gonna head to this workout um, I've got my gym bag here I put like this hip thrust pad and then I have a towel. Oh my gosh, I ruined the towel here, whoops. I have an ankle strap, and then I have like the wristbands to help you with like heavy weights. Oh, and a water bottle. So today's gym fit, I'm wearing this oversized Zeppelin t-shirt from Urban Outfitters, and I have my hair the same as yesterday, crimped, except I put like my little bangs away. Um, keep my hair out of my face because leg days get pretty sweaty. And I'm wearing these um, Her Movement shorts. I love them. And then I'm wearing my Converse and white socks. Honestly, I have to clean my white shoes so bad. Like I have to clean both the Vans and these ones. I just haven't done that because I hate waiting for them to dry. I feel like they take forever to dry. I need to figure out some time to do that. The positive, um, hold on one second, you guys. Like I was saying, you guys, manifestation is something that I really wanna work on this year with like saying things out loud, believing in it and trusting that good things are going to happen. I really feel like when you put that energy out, you're almost putting yourself in that mindset as if it is already happening. So I feel like that's really helping a lot and I feel like it is really working. Just the past week, I mean, it is still the beginning. I think it's the fifth today. I already feel like things are working out for the best. So try saying some affirmations, try manifesting things, saying things out loud to yourself in the mirror, just to yourself in general when you first wake up. You know, today's gonna be a great day. I'm gonna accomplish a lot today. Saying those things out loud really helps you put yourself in a better mindset than not really saying a thing is at all and like kind of going through your phone and filling your mind with things that are on social media. I feel like social media can kind of bring us down a little hole sometimes, especially getting us unmotivated and like not being as consistent as we should be. So anyways, let's go ahead, head to the gym. I'm ready for this leg day workout and I will see you guys there. I literally didn't even start working out, but my dad just called me and we have to go run some errands. So I'm gonna come back to the gym later. So it's gonna be a lot darker um, because the sun's already going down. It's already, what time is it? It's already three o'clock um, and it gets dark by like six. So I'll check in with you guys around six-ish for my workout. I'm not missing my workout, guys. I just have to run some errands. And whoa, whoa, whoa. Yeah. yeah, sometimes we laugh, sometimes we cry, but I guess you know now yeah. Baby, yeah. I took a half and she took the whole thing, slow down yeah. Baby, yeah. we took a trip, now we on your blood, and it's like a ghost town yeah. Baby, yeah. where did these niggas be at when they said they going out, it's not it you can't even pay me enough to react 
Been waking up in the crib, but sometimes I don't even know where I'm at. Please don't pay that nigga sounds in this party, I can't even listen to that. Anytime that I run into somebody, it must be a victory lap, hey. Shawty come sit on my lap, hey. They say I'm Tracy, just snap. This in between us, is not like a store, this isn't a closable gap, hey. I see some niggas attack, and don't end up making it back. I know that they had the crib going crazy down bad. What they had didn't last, damn, baby. Yeah. Where did these niggas be at when they said they doing all this and all that? So I just did some running around, but I ordered some food for pickup. So I ordered some pad thai and some spring rolls. I'll show it to you guys. I wanted to make some chicken stir fry, but I forgot to take out the chicken and I was busy all day. It took forever. Um, I'll explain it in like my next vlog because I'm super excited to tell you guys, but um, I'm about to, yeah, eat the takeout food because I did not have energy to cook. So that's what happens to me that you guys, I told you, I don't really like. I kind of just go with the flow each week. So yeah, sometimes I'm gonna cook and sometimes I'm going to buy food. Good morning, you guys. So I'm just about to head to the gym. It's 8.50 right now and I'm about to do a full body workout. This is like, I'll show you guys the fit in a second. Let me move it over here. Don't know how I feel about it, but I'm wearing these like, I've talked about them before on my channel, but they're from the Glow Mode collection off the Sheen website. So I'll link it down below, but they're like, I swear they're like Align dupes, like Align Lululemon. They're like dupes of them, but they come in like different colors. This is like a nice vibrant blue. I don't know if you guys noticed, but blue has been like my favorite color lately. Like, especially with my gym clothes and stuff. I love the way blue looks like, and I love the contrast with black and blue. And that's what I'm wearing. And I paired it up with this Elf Elite um, crop top, but we're gonna do a full body workout. I actually had some coffee earlier, so I don't really need pre-workout. I didn't realize I worked today at all. Like I literally thought I had the whole day off. And then my girlfriend texted me from work and she reminded me that I worked today. So I have work at 11. We're just gonna go ahead and get into our full body workout and then I will make food afterwards. And then I was gonna make stir fry today because I thought I had the day off. So I'm gonna have to think of something quick to make. Yeah, we'll see. Yeah, yeah. I mean, where the fuck should I really even start? I got hoes that I'm keeping in the dark. I got my niggas cross the street living large. Thinking back to the fact that they dead. Thought my raps were the facts that they sat with the bars. I got two phones, one need a charge. Yeah, they twins, I can tell they ass apart. I got big packs coming on the way. I got big stacks coming out to save. I got a Lil Max with me, he the wave. It's a big gap between us and the game. In the next life, I'm trying to stay paid. When I die, I put my money in the when I die, I put my money in a grave. I really gotta put a couple niggas in a place. Really just slap every nigga in a race. I really might tap till this nigga on my face. Lil CC, let it slap with the bass. I used to save hoes with a mask in a cave. Now I'm like, nah, love, I'm good, go away. Ain't about to die with no money I don't gave. I was on top when that shit meant a lot. So I totally forgot, I had to grab something for the lady that works here in my building. I always see her, she's the cleaning lady. I texted her to come to the gym. Oh, did you get my text? Yeah. Okay, but I forgot I had something for you. It was for Christmas. Oh, thank you so much. Yeah, yeah you can read it. It was just a cute little message. Okay. But as I was saying, She's such a sweet lady. You can just tell she's like super hard working in our building. And I kind of grew like a little connection with her because every time I'm in the gym, I usually would see her. I haven't seen her in a bit um, because I wasn't consistent with the gym in December, but I did like that was my intention was to get her something for Christmas. So I got her a little gift card, some of the places she might like. It was like a variety of different places. And then I just wrote her a little cute message in the card, but I just wanted to make sure I had that for her. And I saw her already and I totally forgot to give it to her. I'm just gonna have some toast and then I'm gonna put this hot sauce on because I'm like in love with it and then I'm just gonna have a fried egg on it so pretty basic guys I am like running late so that is what I'm having for breakfast and then for dinner lunch I'm gonna have to buy food because I forgot I was working today so so it is Saturday it is the last day of my why don't I ever shut this but I got home not too long ago from work it is 7 40 so it's almost 8 and the gym closes at 10 like my gym 
so I need to work out. I'm like debating if I want to have like a energy drink. I want to do some editing, but then I have to wake up early because I'm going to go to Seattle tomorrow to explore. So I want to be like, you know, I don't want to be tired because sometimes when I'm tired, I get grumpy and I don't want to get grumpy. So for today's workout, I'm actually just going to do cardio. So I'm going to do like um, the snare master and the treadmill. And I want to do each for 30 minutes each. Oh, I'm pushing it. We'll do the Stairmaster and treadmill. I want to aim for about 40 minutes of that cardio, 40 to 45 minutes, and then 15 minutes of like an ab exercise. So I'll probably do like a couple um, like bicycles, crunches. I really don't know what they're called, but I definitely want to implement some more like ab exercises in my workouts because I don't really do ab exercises a lot. So we're gonna do that. But yeah, we're just gonna head to the gym. It's gonna be super quick. But the fit for today, just decided not to load my face with makeup because I went to work and I had no makeup on. So I'm kind of just like, mm, not gonna do it. I was gonna put my earrings in, put like some concealer, Vaseline, some powder, contour a little bit, like just to color my face up. And this is the fit. The shoes, I gotta put them on properly. Black leggings, and I'm gonna wear this like cropped black hoodie because I'm not gonna take it off because I didn't shave my armpits, so I'm not gonna do that. I'm gonna take a shower after. Hey, feeling young, but they treat me like the OG. And they want to tea on me, I swear these bitches nosy. Said he put some money on my head, I guess we gon' see. I won't put no money on this head, my niggas owe me. I gotta be single for a while, you can't control me. Who no those traits in a race, they can't hold me. And I show my face in a case, so you know it's me. Imitation is a flattery, it's just annoying me. And I'm too about it. And the dirt that they do on my name turn to soil, and I grew up it. Time for y'all to figure out what y'all gonna do about it. Big wheels keep rolling, rolling. I'm outside, 29, G5, Seaside. I've been losing friends and finding peace. But honestly, that sounds like a fair trade to me if I ever heard one and I'm still here outside. Yeah, I burnt my salmon. <laughs> I put too much sauce and my asparagus and rice. So that's what I'm gonna eat. And that's the food for today. So I think it looks, it still looks really good. You know, not too bad. Yeah, I got feelings for you, that's the thing about it. Yeah, you know that it's something when I sing.